Hi, my name is Beth Hiley here for Board Game Geek, and I'm sitting down with Giuliano Aquanti. Hello. Of Cranio Creations. Yes. And you've brought us a number of games, but the first one we're going to start with is Council of Four. Yes. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Uh, Council of Four is a strategic game, but it's quite easy to understand the rules and to play it. So, uh, it's not a family game, but sort of, of a family game. <laughs> So the core of the game is a, a, a placing game. We are merchants and we try to build our shops in the cities of the map. And each time we build, we gain benefits. At the end of the game, the player with the most victory points win the game. Um, there are four different actions that you can do during the game. So each round, each player has only one action to do. So it's quite easy. One action is to change the council. As you can see, there are four councils in the kingdom. One council facing each region. As you can see, there are three regions. During the setup, there are two faces for each board. Oh, so the, the, uh, the setup has a, a variety. And during the setup, we place this token on each city randomly so there are uh, um, one more var variety on the setup the last thing on the setup is the nobles in the council And as you can see, there are four different nobles in each council. There are six colors of the nobles, so there are some nobles that are waiting outside the board. <laughs> Hoping. Yes. So, um, we have a set of seven cards at the start of the game, and at the beginning of each round, we draw one card. And as you can see, there are different colors on the card and they match with the color All of right, the All right, yeah, so, so really just... <laughs> White. Just, just a color. <laughs> purple, orange, black, light blue, violet, and a joker, a multicolor <laughs> card. So, um, when we want to uh, play an action that concerns a council, we have to play cards from our hands that match the color of the nobles inside. If we play all the four colors, we pay nothing. If we, uh, if we play less cards than the four nobles, we pay more money. We can uh, play one uh, card and pay ten money. <laughs> okay? So one action is change the nobles inside the council because maybe we want that a purple counts, uh, noble goes inside. So we just put in inside from the left. And literally bump them out. And the, <laughs> the lever goes out. So we can do this as an action during our round. Each time we place a new noble inside the council, we earn four <laughs> coins, okay? And this is an action. Another action is to build one of these tiles. So as you can see, on each tile there is a letter. And I'm guessing corresponds to the letter yes. of the city. <laughs> yes, it does. Because each tile is a permission to build on one or two or three uh, cities. So when we buy these tiles, one round later, we can build our shop in that city, okay? But to buy this card, we have to satisfy the council. Okay. So we play the cards, we pay the money if we don't play I all the four perfectly. cards, and we take the cards. Each time we take the tile, we earn the immediate benefits of the card. There are five elements in the game. There are money, there are victory points, Assistance. So the assistance Hello, yeah, can help us during the game. So we have we can earn and spend assistance to do other actions. Okay, I'm guessing uh, we're drawing more cards. More cards. Draw more mm -hmm. cards. That's it. Here there are two lines. The money 
track. So each time we earn and we spend money, Let's we move, move our marker up or down. This track is the uh, noble track. So each time we take this benefit All right. from a city or from a tile, we go up in this track. And I'm guessing you get the, the bonus, as, bonus you... as you go on. Mm -hmm. That's it. So each time we build our shop in a city using one tile that we have, we get the bonus of, the, of that city. So for example, I build here and I get one assistant. If later during the game I build another shop in a city that is connected by a route to another city where I already have a shop, I gain both the benefits. Ah, nice. So my aim in the game is to create a chain of city connected by my shops. So each time I build a new shop, I gain all the benefits together. And I'm noticing that you have a great player aid that lays out pretty much every all your choices yes. of what you're able to do on your turn right yes. here. During your turn, you have four main actions that you can do. And that is buy a tile, build a, uh, a shop. shop using one tile or using the king. I'll explain that yeah. later. And then and change the someone out. As you can see, there is a king in the uh, middle of the map, we can build our shop using the king. So this is the council of the king. Th those are the council for, for each, each region. region. Okay. So when we want to use the king, we satisfy the council of the king. Because maybe you had the cards that corresponded to that group yes. better than these groups. And then we can, if we want, move the king. We pay two money for each route that the king uh, goes through, and then we immediately build one shop where the king stops. And I'm guessing these things over here are all little extras that you can do on your turn, yes, using a lot of these assistants are, to help you out. Yes, and, so these are, mm -hmm. sorry, uh, these four are the um, extra action that you can do during your round. You, can, you have to do one main action and you can, you if you do. want, uh, make another uh, small action. Well, and we'll, I'll say, we'll save those for people who want to learn the whole okay, rules, but no there's problem. some extra actions you can do. Yes, <laughs> they are quite easy, and there now, are only four. What triggers the end of the game? Person. So <laughs> we start with 10 Emporiums, and the first player who built his last one trigger the game. So we all have one more turn to go, and then the game's end. How long would a full game take you? In four players, uh, 70 minutes if you uh, are at the first game, but you can play for an hour. All right. Yes. Well, if you guys are interested in checking this out, this is Council of Four by Cranial Creations. Thank you.